Christian's not allowed to watch this though. Why? Because I'm not meant to be eating any of this. I saw your eyes. A sense of threat that I can't forget. I wanna know who you are. This what I need to know. Is this the multi one? <laughs> Right. <laughs> yeah. Hi guys, so um, I am just putting some cakes together. We're waiting for Uncle Chunks to open. It opens at half past ten. And then me, Matt, Maisie, Mila and Cash are all going to head down there and we're going to let the kids run wild. So let's see what happens. Mm. Mm. Ooh. 
I like it. How about the toilets? Oh my goodness, what does that mean? Oh my god. Do you want to try this? These actually taste really nice. Do you want to try one? Yeah, please. This is birthday cake cookie dough. Oh. It's nice. <gasps> Do you like it? Oh, great then. Birthday cake cookie dough boy. Oh do you want me to undo that? Oh my goodness, mom. That is amazing. Amazing. Don't eat it through the packet. <laughs> Are you ready? Ooh, what is this? What is it? Oh, that looks like a dog treat. Oh, I'm so glad you said treat. <gasps> because I thought she was going to say that it looks like a dog. <laughs> you said it! <laughs> Pick the next thing. What should we try? Uh, should we try these? Yeah. Apple pie kick I'm definitely trying I'm definitely I like the fruit. Oh, smell it. Oh, that smells like strawberries. I hope it doesn't smell like strawberries. What flavour is it? It's crisp wafers in apple pie flavoured white cream, naturally and artificially flavoured. Have you got a problem with it? This stinks. It smells nice. Ready? Why don't you just try it with me? Come on. You live life on this. Bite it. I'm gonna dip it in the tea. <gasps> Are you really? Yes, I am. Why? <coughs> Ready? Oh. <gasps> yeah. You're crazy, Mom. I'm fine. You're crazy. You're crazy. No, you're crazy. You're crazy. No, you're crazy. Mind your fingers. Is this the multi one? Multi two, yeah. Did you just try it? Did you want that? Oh, who did you want that? I've already, okay, I'll try one of those with you. Mina's tried one of those to spat it over over there. Okay. What colour do you want? I think I love it. No, no! Okay, you always need your bag. There's your red one. No! I'm going to have blue. Okay. Do you want a green one? Yeah. Yes, what? Yes, please. My pale smile, <laughs> I mean, it's had too much sugar already today. Ready? Let's pull it together. Okay. After three. One, two, three. Oh, you put the whole thing in? What? That is nice. What? Are you keen on it? I like that word, are you keen on it? Are you keen? Mmm. I mean, it just tastes like pure sugar, but... I like it. Oh my god! What? They're flavoured. What colour did we just eat? I have red. Do you have what colour did we just eat? We have blue. Oh, I have red. Did you open your mouth? Are you sure? Yeah, you had blue oh, no, no, no. Mine's blue raspberry, yours was cherry. Does it oh. taste like cherry? Yeah. Have you ate yours? Yours was green. Yours was green apple. <laughs> yeah. Oh, Mina's got more Krabby Patties. Oh, my. Do you want to eat a normal crab? Oh my gosh, I've dropped it on the floor. No. <laughs> I put all the crab in. Yeah. Do you want another one? No. Do you want me to open this? It's open. Do you want me to open it? You want me to open it? This. Do you want 
queuing for you as you can see we are out on the street and what i want to do is physically point out where we are and where you can park so behind me on the left hand side you've got the Talbot, um which is a public car park as well as for the patrons of the pub as you can see here where the road splits into two we enter onto a one-way system i really want to point that out because you can't come back this way you can only come back on the other side of the road and as we walk up here, this is how we get towards the shop. So let's go. Over the edge, feel like I'm my mind is breathing. So 
so we are just approaching the co-op which is on the left hand side as you can see as we go up there there are signs to say that camping's in process so please do not park on here also on the right hand side here there is just a small car park that you can park on to and as we go round this corner here if you want to show them what the road map so as we go round this corner here this is where the shop is this point of the road you can't actually see our shop that's because we are slightly set back off the road as you approach the shop we are on the left hand side you'll see our hanging sign off the front of the shop that should be the first thing that you see so this whole road is pretty much double yellowed please don't park on any double yellows please don't park on any dropped curves Please don't block anybody's driveways. It's really important that we look after our local residents. And even though you guys absolutely love to come on a Saturday and we're a small village and we don't have a massive amount of parking, um, I really don't want to upset any of the local residents. So we need to be really mindful about where we park. So, I better breath. <laughs> We are approaching the shop now. Where Maisie is standing is just where we kind of like to sit back a little bit. So, we're going to point out where you queue. You can't queue on this side of the road, this side of the shop rather, because the footpath is way too small. So we have to queue to the left hand side is this side so your door is here queue starts here you need to maintain social distancing which is two meters away from everyone that's in the queue please obviously you can stay within your bubble so even if there's more than two of you as long as you are staying together you stay within your bubble that's absolutely fine if we go up the road a little bit here we do have a shop next to us there is an entrance towards the end of the building. What I would really like to request is that no one blocks this doorway. So here, there is a doorway. Please leave a six foot gap a lot in front of this doorway. It allows the customers of this shop to go in without having to affect the queue. That would be fantastic. Across the road, in front of the shop, these are clearly marked two car bay which you can park in for up to 30 minutes this is monitored by a traffic officer so please be mindful there's a car park directly opposite the shop which is owned by david paradigm you are not allowed to park on here please do not park on here um, again, I don't want to upset the company, it's their private land, we're not allowed to use it. On the road that we are on, there is various spaces for you to park with no double yellows. So, if you spin around that, where all those cars are on the right hand side here, that is all non-double yellowed. And normally you will find a space on this road somewhere there. A road directly in front of us which has not got double yellows in towards the bottom just be really mindful when you park um, I know it's hard I know we get a queue on a Saturday and everyone's eager to get in the queue um, but let's look after each other let's think about each other okay guys thanks for watching we've been to Uncle Chunk's Munch we spent a lot of money in there the kids chose what they wanted We've done a review on what we liked and what we didn't like. And now the kids are gonna go home and I'm gonna to continue to work. So thanks for watching, we really appreciate it. Like, comment, subscribe, give us a share, tag us on your Instagram story. It all helps and we really appreciate it. Yeah. Bye.